everyone, Miri here and welcome back to my channel. Today I was finally able to play a tape with Dev. I haven't played it in like 6 days and I keep saying that I will play it but sadly time worked against me. But thankfully I was able to do it for like at the very least 30 minutes tonight before going to sleep. Mainly because my scheduling went to hell again and I'm trying to get it back on track. But that's besides the point right now. The point is that I miss Grimm deeply and I found out during the conversation that we have in like the third or fourth day, if I'm not mistaken, that he sent pictures of himself with, with a wide range of emotion confirmed by him to make chibi emojis for the chat. It was so cute because it is confirmed off screen that he in fact pouted for one of the pictures. Oh my god, it would have been so adorable to have the the the, the full face instead of the chibi one. It would have been so cute. Also, I really love how he talks about artists that he basically commissioned the, the artist because in his words Morals deserve pay, deserve pay for their job, and it was pretty sweet. So, essentially, regardless of whether he could ask the player, I mean us, or or an artist, he still like values work, and I am so here for that. <laughs> also, when it came to drawing Eiichi, ergo Prince Eric as Tadano. Yesterday I mentioned that I struggled with the eyes because I I struggled a lot. God, I repeated myself. <laughs> I pretty much just took like about half an hour, maybe two, to get the eyes right. And thankfully it looks better now that I have added the base colors and I tweaked the thing a few of the imperfections on the line art and it actually, and it actually looks even better. I even had to shrink the head a little because I felt that it was too big. So yeah. <laughs> line art wise and base color wise is at a point where I am proud of how it looks, but I still have to add the shading and stuff. I'm thinking about, about for his eyes because you know that Tadano's eyes are basically tiny dots. I am planning on doing the thing where they add like a little bit of shine to his eyes when the camera does a close up and we can see actually his irises. And I believe that will be the only way to get Eric's blue eyes across by you know mimicking that 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 that, that shimmer there you go by mimicking the shimmer that he has in the eye in his eye sometimes i hope that it looks great i truly hope so because i want to be able to do both tadano and prince eric justice like i watched the little mermaid the little mermaid from from the 90s when I was a little kid several times and it holds a special place in my heart. <laughs> also, when it, when it came to, to today and the songs that I played, I gotta say that, that, I, that I was done with the back. I had to get another one once I finished recording. And also, I forgot to mention the other day that I started watching Little Witch Academia and I didn't realize until I read the credits that it was actually made by Studio T Trigger, the same guys behind um, Gurren Lagann, which I really need to watch, and Promar, and also Kill a Kill. I am basically watching another creation from the OGs. <laughs> Also, I am pretty much just thinking of considering watching a Kretsuko, but whenever I go to to actually watch um, Little, Little Witch Academia, I forget that I that I'm also meaning to watch a Kretsuko, and 
maybe once I'm done with Karikato Sakura before watching Clear Card, I could actually watch one of the movies because I have like very hazy memories of of watching it in my teens, but I didn't retain that much. <laughs> anyway, that's all that I have to say for now. Today, even though it's a little bit late in my time zone, I want to go to bed relatively early today to recover the sleep that I missed during the work week. Anyway, see you guys later! <laughs>